this life is balanced but we living here are the ones that are not balanced so guys let's dive into it yeah they send me rocking the sinus wings like a jet i'm the flyest though drip drip harder than a sauna come true tell me what you want hi guys mindy k is out with another bang hey is it that you haven't heard of Dolce and Gabbana? What are you waiting for? Prepare yourself because it's really going to be a blast. Like it's going to be explosive. Like, can you see me rocking designers? Dolce and Gabbana, Dolce and Gabbana goes. It's going to be a blast. Trust me, you don't want to miss it. Download me in the K Gabbana song. Roll it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they send me rocking the sinus Wings like a jet, I'm the flyest though Drip, drip, harder than a sauna Come true, tell me what you wanna do Touchy and the touchy and Gabbana Touchy and the touchy and Gabbana Yeah, we started rocking the sinus Touchy and the touchy and Gabbana When I pull up in a rari Wavy, wavy, oh, oh, tsunami Dental floss with a compari K.H.R. gon' sami When I pull up in a posh Panamera Got me singing, dancing, Guantanamera Oh God, swagger so dumb Tryna get the money, girl, you gotta hold on uh. Yeah, they see me rocking designers Fresh fly, girl, I'm the finest, though Me and Annie killing it, no drama Mesh with me, you gonna get your karma, yo Luciana, Luciana, Gabbana You touch the rope of beam, on like me, I'm drowning the sea But you take the love to see, double scared of what you see I got a couple of scenes, folding up that dead it is She say, he say, I say, they say, making it hard to make me this is only mama told you, I'm not good at making means it's though I'm trying to make the rest of me, need the recipe, what I could be This is making me grab and I end up with grab and I come to say Yeah, they see me rocking designers Fresh fly girl, I'm the finest though Me and Annie killing it, no drama Mess with me, you gonna get your karma, yo Hi lovelies, welcome once again to my channel. I greet you with your time whenever you come across this video. Food for thought. Learn to overcome your challenges. Make a plan. It won't be easy though, but know that you are never alone. Call on the almighty God, but whatever happens, be sure not to give up. Persistence is the key in overcoming challenges but walk away from toxic people as soon as possible just walk away just walk away if you know you are not happy in the relationship 
Just walk away. Just walk away. Just walk away. If you know it's not working out fine for you, just walk away. Just walk away. Just walk away. If your partner is panabiting all the time, just walk away. Just walk away. Just walk away. If you know you are not happy in your marriage, just walk away. Just walk away. Just walk away. If you know you are not happy in that relationship, just take a walk. Just take a walk. Just walk away. If you know your spouse is beating you all the time, just walk away. Just walk away. If you are maltreated, just walk away. If your partner is beating you always, just take a word. Just walk away. Just walk away. If you know you are in a toxic relationship, just walk away. Yes, so my people, if you know you are in a relationship, be it marriage, be it platonic relationship, be it even friendship, okay? And it is not working out fine for you. Just walk away. Take that bold step. No matter what people would say about you, just walk away from that toxic relationship. Except maybe you don't love your life. Except maybe you want to die. Okay? So my people... I think that is the best bet to do even relationship like as i am now say i have a friend a lady as a friend and that person always want to use me wants to use my wisdom and he she is not willing to help me when i ask of help from her i will walk away so this song is not just only for marriage i'm talking about relationship I'm talking about your church members, your pastors, where you worship. If you are in financial needs and your church cannot help you, walk away. Change your church. If your church cannot help you, okay, you change church. If your friends cannot help you, walk away. Look for another set of friends if that is what you need. All right, because life, they say, is scratch my back, I scratch your back. We two hands that God has given us with ten fingers. You use two of them to wash each other before they will be very, very clean if you want to eat a bar. All right? Or swallow. So that is how it's supposed to be in relationship. That is how it's supposed to be in marriage. Walk away from toxic people. Walk away from people that want to make use of your knowledge and they are not willing to give out. Walk away from people who are there as friend for benefits whatever they can gain from you that is where you can see them walk away from people that back by that gossip about people to you because as they are telling people about you that is how they will tell you to about them all right so um walk away that is how they will tell you that is how they will tell them as well about you my people so walk away from friends who are there with uh, the spirit of hypocrisy that are trying to pretend to be good in front of you and they are stabbing you behind. Walk away from people who don't put anything meaningful and positive in your life. Walk away from people who you know that are friends but you are seeing them as enemies okay because the devil you know is better than the angel you don't know they are pretending as if they are angels okay and they are your enemy take that both step and walk away from their life so my people 
I will say in this video that don't marry because you got pregnant for him. Don't marry because you don't want to lose the person. Don't marry because of family prejudices. Don't marry because you like the idea of marriage. Don't marry because of pity or out of pity. Don't marry because this person is from this tribe. That is to say, you are marrying because of tribe. Don't marry because you admire wedding gown. You see, they are beautiful, but it's not how beautiful they are that marriage is when you enter. Okay? Sometimes. So don't marry because you love kids. Don't marry because all your friends are getting married. You are going for a shabby friends committee all the time. You are an event planner when it comes to marriage, but it's not your time. And you not decided to go and marry two by four man or ritualist or money making machine. My people, if you dare that to somebody that doesn't love you, ROIP will be your name. So don't marry because of physical and academic qualifications. Some are there, they will tell you that ah, I cannot marry somebody that is lower than my degree. I have BSc. Now, if I want to marry, I will go for somebody that have master's or doctorate degree. Marriage is not about qualification. Marriage is all about love, understanding, communication, trust, commitments, and lots more. Okay? Marry because you want to fulfill destiny in life. Not because of uh, people are marrying. So... You, you, you want to marry so don't marry also because of what you are lonely don't do that some people do that because they are lonely they will want to marry don't marry because of sex because if you say because of sex your partner will get it multiple times even more better off than you sometimes outside so don't marry because he can perform well in bed or she can perform well in bed don't marry because you are getting old. Don't marry because you are of age. People, they do this one well, well. They go say, eh, I don't they old, do. Eh, why be better they come for a bomb bomb, for a show? Let me look for somebody to go and hook up. At the end of the day, now you will cry. That is how it is. So, don't marry because of loneliness. Some people are like that. They can say, ah, I am an introvert. Eh? I don't know how to make friends. Okay, let me look for one bobo or one woman to stay with. And uh, just hook up like that. So, for me not to lose anything. My people, don't do that. Because at the end of the day, it is you that wears the shoes, that knows where it pinches. Marry, if at all, because... Marriage is what fulfilled by God. That is what God made us to understand. Because if you want to fulfill your destiny in life, walk away from people who will say themselves as too busy to return your call or test. No one is ever too busy to return your call or test. Not even the president of America. If you think anyone is so busy to respond to you, test them by sending them a test saying, your money was mistakenly paid to me. They will reply in seconds. If I am lying, drop your comments in the comment section. The reason they do not take your calls or reply to your test messages is because you are not relevant to them. Don't you think so? That is why I said walk away from people like that. It is not because they are too busy. Everybody will be forming busy. It's not true. Do you want them to start taking you seriously? This is a big question. Then make yourself scarce by walking away. And use the period of your scarceness to grow your relevance. My people, they said enough is enough for the wise. Okay? If you know that what I talked about in this video is relevant, drop your comment as well. Goodbye for now.